Hey fellow backyard boyers, Nick here. Now today I just wanted to, you know, do a little something for you guys, just a little uh, demonstration, if you will. So here I have a wooden bow, as you can tell. It's a red oak board bow. I made this about two years ago. Um, it's just been sitting in my closet. It's a fairly decent bow. Uh, it's not my best. But, you know, I kind of like it. Now, what I wanted to do for you guys today is just kind of show you guys what happens when you push a wooden bow too far. Now, you've all seen what happens to the PVC pipe bows. The wood doesn't have the benefit of being able to fold like PVC. So I just wanted to show you guys what will happen. You know, this isn't indicative of all wooden bows. You know, the quality of the wood and different things do factor in. But this is pretty indic this is going to be pretty indicative of what would happen. Now this bow is 60 inches long, so it's kind of a short bow, but it's for a shorter draw. It's uh, 40 pounds at 26 inches. But when I made this, I made it, you know, for kids in mind. It was actually a, made for a 24 inch draw, so really short draw. So I'm going to show you guys today. Uh, I'm going to shoot this bow a couple times and then I'm going to overdraw it until it breaks and then you can see what that looks like. So, without further ado. There we go. So now, just to protect my head and neck, just in case anything happens, I'm going to be wearing this. Here we go. Actually, that was, that was actually really nice. I don't think I've ever had a bow break on me that nicely before. I think it might have something to do with the fact that I tried to make it break. Because usually they're not so nice. Uh, so here it is. Yeah. So, at this point, there's really not much I could do to fix this. I could possibly splice this back together, but since this is right on a mid limb, you know, which is working limb, it's not going to work so well. So, effectively, this bow's dead. And there's really nothing I can do with it. Can't really shorten it. Could probably make an Adelaide out of this limb, though. That looks promising. Yeah, so that's it. I just wanted to show you guys, you know, just an example of what a wooden bow looks like if it breaks. Now, this is really light and really gentle compared to uh, what I've seen of most bows. But, you know, it was a lighter weight bow. It was made from a board, which was kind of, you know, just waiting to break at some point. But there it is. Now, thanks for, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.